Hello, welcome to a first tutorial about the CSV import tool. Uh, you can get the CSV import tool from the plugin directory of WordPress. Um, you can download it and install it on your favorite site. And then you should have an extra option here saying CSV import. And you have a few add ons you can buy on my site. Here they are to import attributes, import custom fields, and import variable products. Let's first take a look at the Excel file. I prepared one. Uh, well, it just has the basic setup, stock, price, tags. Uh, you can have multiple tags uh, separated by a pipe. Uh, you can have categories, multiple, or you can have uh, subcategories, uh, images, of course, um, multiple images. Um, and you also can have an URL as an image. Well, how to actually import now? This is the question. The first thing you do is you go to your settings part. You check if you have the right field separator, which in my case is a semicolon. I have a header, so uh, I want first line, and I want to process one row at the same time, just to see if it's working. Now we will set up a header, you just pick your CSV file you have with all the products in, you load it and you check. You get a preview over here and you check if the actual values are right. Well, here it says image and it should be images. Well, this all looks okay now. So when I done this, I press save and my header is saved. Now the import tool knows what fields to expect where. When I go to import, I select the file again, press load, it shows me the preview again, and I will run it. And it shows here the progress until it's finished. Well, it's only a few rows. And now I can see at my products part, here are all the products. Uh, it also imports the if the, the media is not present, it imports it. And if it's already there, then it will just link the file. So this one wasn't already there, and now it's imported here. If you look at the products themselves, you see here the multiple tags. Uh, you see over here, it has created product categories for them. Uh, and also your product gallery is filled when you have two, uh, one or two images. Well, this is it. You can do this with uh, 10 products, also with 1000 products. Um, the only thing you have to take care of is if you do a lot of imports, please do not put this number too high because else you can run into timeouts. Okay, thank you very much. This was it. And if you have any questions, you can go to the WordPress page.